Llewellyn, two Aaron Boy, Seamus Durak, three is Gentle Rivers, Tom Jenks, four Highland comes out. It's a non runner. Number five is Kermar, Jason Titley, six Manx Magic, Tony McCoy, seven My Good Son, Jason McGuire, number eight is No Discount, Charlie Swan, no, t no, ta I should say nine, No Tale to Tell, Adrian McGuire, number ten is Royal Castle, Chris Maud, eleven Sackville, Barry Geraghty, 12 shotgun willie is a non-runner 13 the bunny boiler paul carberry 14 is vanilla man tom tracy 15 is what's up boys richard johnson 16 is wild spice timmy murphy coming in now to replace norman williamson who's a bit shaken after that fall in the previous race 17 is hattie roy jim cullity 18 clandestine robert thornton and 19 is snug fit rosie Tony Dobbin. So two non-runners there, four Highland and 12 Shotgun Willie, leaving 17 to go and an interesting betting race. It certainly is, uh, Jim, and Binderi has been the most popular horse of the day. Six to one in the offices uh, uh, with Hills and Surrey Racing this morning. Uh, nine to two open on the course. It's now back to seven to two, along with no discount on his joint favourite. What's up, boys? Is an eight to one chance with Errant Boy tens and Gentle Rivage also tens. Manx Magic is twelve to one with Sackville also twelves. Vanilla Man is twelve to one as well. Snugfit Rosie is out to sixteens from fourteens. The Bunny Boiler is a sixteen to one chance with Kermar twenties. Clandestine is uh, one of those on the twenty and twenty-five to one mark. No Tell to Tell is also 25s. Hattie Roy is out to 33s from 25s. Royal Castle 33s, Wild Spice 50s. And My Good Son, the rank outsider, at 66 to 1. See no discount begins on the outside and drops back towards the rear. Heading up towards the first of 13 flights and the leader to it is the Bunny Boiler from Kermar over on the far side and Vanilla Man and Binderi are up there early. All over the first safely, Gentle Rivage is just behind them, then Aaron Boy over on the far side. My Good Son is next, followed then by Manx Magic and What's Up Boys. Then on the inside, Sackville from Snugfit Rosie is trapped out a little bit wide at the first turn. Royal Castle back in the field at this stage, followed then by No Tail to Tell, who's back towards the rear of the field with Clandestine and also No Discount as third last, Hattie Roy second last. Last of all is Wild Spice as they head into the back now and a long run before they reach the second flight. Kermar is the leader, half a length to Binderi, two lengths away, Gentle Rivage, followed by the Bunny Boiler. Two lengths away then is Aaron Boy, who's travelling on the inside of Vanilla Man, and What's Up Boys is right there in the centre. Not handier today at the second. Followed then by Sackville, and further back is Manx Magic, who's out wide. They're followed next in the field then by Clandestine and Snugfit Rosie. Right on the inside is Royal Castle from My Good Son. Further back in the field behind My my Good Son is No Tale to Tell, followed then by Wild Spice. Out deeper on the track is No Discount as they go over the third, and Hattie Roy is dropped back to last. Heading up the side now, towards the fourth, going back through the field there, you can see the Bunny Boiler, but Kermar led over that one. They're all over that safely as they prepare to leave the back. Kermar shows the way from Binderi up on the outside in the starred jacket of Jenny Mould. And then next in the field is Gentle Rivage on the inside as they prepare to leave the back now. Gentle Rivage followed by Manx Magic, a length and a half, the Bunny Boiler with What's Up Boys and Snug Fit Rosie is trapped wide. Vanilla Man is just behind them, followed by Aaron Boy, and then out deeper on the track, Clandestine. No Tail to Tell is next, two lengths to Sackville from Royal Castle is back in the field. No Discount is starting a forward move now, followed by My Good Son and Wild Sp Spice and two or three lengths to Hattie Roy is last of all. Coming around the home turn and straightening up towards three flights that await them in the home straight. Kermar is the leader by two lengths to Binderi in the green jacket. Then Gentle Rivage and Manx Magic, Tony McCoy on the outside. Followed then by Snugfit Rosie who's moving up. The grey face in the centre is What's Up Boys is very handy. Just in behind them the Bunny Boiler. Followed next by Aaron Boy as they go over flight number six. Further back behind Aaron Boy is uh, in the centre, Clandestine, and then Vanilla Man from Royal Castle. Wild Spice taking closer order as they come to the seventh. The leaders crash through that. 
Vanilla Man is next, followed by Sackville. Then on the outside, No Tail to Tell. Then No Discount is third, last from Hattie Roy, and last of all is My Good Son. A circuit to go and six to jump in this Belle Epoch Sefton Novices hurdle. Kermar, the leader out of the straight by half a length to Bindari and What's Up Boys third. Poised on the outside, a length further back is Gentle Rivage, followed then by Manx Magic. Out wider is Snug Fit Rosie from Erin Boy is Scraping Paint. Two lengths then to Clandestine from Vanilla Man. Then the Bunny Boiler going backwards from Sackville and then out wider, No Tail to Tell. Wild Spice is next, followed by No Discount who's got about 10 lengths to make up but going forward now from Royal Castle then my good son and Hattie Roy at the rear of the field heading down the back now this is six out and Bindari jumped into the lead by half a length the soda Kerma here comes what's up boys on the outside half a length away is gentle rivage a gap in the field then to snug fit Rosie next on the outside vanilla man from clandestine as they come towards five out and what's up boys on the outside has ranged up to grab a narrow lead. No tail to tell a mistake back in the field. Bindari is still there fighting it out though and it's uh, Bindari and uh, What's Up boys together as they come now towards four out. Just in behind them at this stage is Gentle, Re Gentle Rivage and Snug Fit Rosie. The white face on the outside. Kermar behind them from Vanilla Man. They're followed next by Sackville and no discount has come from near last. Is making up ground rapidly on the outside but still seven or eight lengths off the pace. They leave the back now and race across the top of the track. And the leader is What's Up Boys. Half a length to General Rivage in the centre there, Vanilla Man. Followed then by Bindari on the inside. The Green Jacket Sackville is coming up as well. Followed then by No Discount who's coming into it pretty stylishly as well from Erin Boy. They're followed by Manx Magic and further back in the field, Wild Spice Clandestine and Snug Fit Rosie has called it a day. On the turn for home, they've got three flights left to jump in this Belle Epoque uh, Sefton Novices hurdle. What's up, boys? The grey strikes the front of the centre now, comes towards three out and jumps it like a stag. Gentle Rivage, a danger on the near side under the whip. Sackville is coming there strongly. No discounts come from another county. Uh, Snug Fit Rosie's been pulled up. Coming towards two out now. What's up, boys? Being challenged and passed by Sackville. Just behind them is no discount. Called on for an effort now. Still making ground from Gentle Rivage and further back Aaron Boy. Vanilla Man, one left to jump, Sackville in front, coming towards the last now, jumps it well, full of running, lands over at four in front now, no discount is under the whip, they're followed by What's Up Boys, a hundred yards left to go though, it's Sackville, Barry Garrity, who rides call it a day in the Grand National tomorrow, this is a nice pipe opener for him, as Sackville comes up to the line to win well, the Irish train Sackville wins it by six lengths, second is no discount, a one-two for Ireland, third in the race then, What's Up Boys from Gentle Rivage fourth, followed just in behind them by Aaron Boy, Vanilla Man, then Bindari, followed by Manx Magic, then the Bunny Boiler. Behind them is Wild Spice from Royal Castle, who's back in the field with Kermar. They're followed by No Tail to Tell, Clandestine. They're still coming in. My good son and Hattie Roy are two of the last, and Snug Fit Rosie, of course, was pulled up. Number 11, Sackville at 12 to 1. Second, number 8, No Discount, 3 to 1 favourite. Third, number 15, What's Up, Boys, at 8 to 1.